morning. Welcome to my channel, Dougie Shaven. The sun is coming up here in Austin, Texas. It's going to be a nice, beautiful day. I've got my Farrah breakfast blend this morning. Coffee roasted right here in Austin, Texas. Good stuff. Today I'm going to be working with my Woodland Sticks. This is Voodoo Ray. And I've got my Parker 24C open comb with a brand new feather in it. Looking for a nice tight shave today. Going to be featuring Hendrix Classics and Company Bay Rum. Really great scent on this one. Super great scent. Going to be finishing off with their nice balm. My, I'm really not a dirty person, folks. I know I've got stuff on my hands, but I got into a fight with my printer last night, and it won't come off. So, um, anyway, let's get this shave going on here. Nice warm water to start off with. It's game day today, folks. I've got my burnt orange on. University of Texas is going to be hosting the Rice Owls here at Daryl K. Royal Stadium in Austin, Texas. Got my Prorasso Red. This has a nice sandalwoody scent, which is, I think, going to work well today with my Bay Rum scented soap. We got our butts handed to us last week in Arkansas. We were picked to win by seven, and it was just horrific. I mean, it was absolutely brutal. <laughs> it was so, oh, it was terrible. So, um, we're playing Rice here in town this this week. Hopefully, we 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 win because <laughs> it was it was really bad. I'm so tired right now. Stayed up late last night playing video games with my son. Call of Duty until like 3 o'clock in the morning. And it was brutal. We got kicked there too, man. Couldn't believe it. Playing against these kids overseas. And, and they just whooped up on us. I love this Woodland Sticks brush. The skull fits perfectly in my hand. And it splays very nicely so I can get a little exfoliation done on my skin here. Prepping for the shave to come, especially with that open comb, because, I mean, she's pretty serious with a, uh, a feather blade in it. Tell you, this Hendrix uh, soap, really, really great lather. Um, Pete tells me it's his top shelf base is what he calls it. And uh, just, just a wonderful, wonderful lather. He's got three different types of butter in it. Um, one past Ben said he needed to get some toast. There was so much butter up in this stuff. I thought that was hilarious. But super, super great, great soap base. And you can check them on uh, HendrixClassics.com uh, or on Facebook in the group, The Selective Shaver. Uh, they post uh, a lot of really great content up there about what they got going on. And... All right. Break out the Parker. Ooh, that's tight. So close. I really like this long 
handle. It uh, fits my big old bass playing hands really well. And I, I gotta tell you, man, feather blades are my, my favorite. I was shaving the other day and I put a non feather in my my razor and it was just horrible. I I just after not even getting one pass done, I I stopped, took the blade out, put a second use feather in there and it was back to back to shaving and it was good again. But now I'm a, a double edge guy. I have got straights. I love to hone. And I have my feather shavette. That will teach you. I mean, if you can if you can shave with a, a shavette, you're you can shave with anything. I use the uh feather pros up in it and uh and those are those are really really great blades now i saw a video the other day where they have like a uh, a guard on it i think they wrap stuff around it or something i don't know i haven't tried those yet but i'd be interested in seeing how that those help but i mean on a shave at that's where you learn angles really quick I've gotten a few memory lines from that bad boy. So yeah, we're playing we're playing rice today, and uh, Coach Sarkeesian has uh, benched. Well, not benched. I'm not going to say benched. He has changed quarterbacks. Uh, the guy that started the first two games is now. He says he's going to play them both. So, and that's what he did with both quarterbacks in the first two games that we played. Uh, so, we shall see. So, folks, for you double edge people out there, um, you know, you've got a single blade right, right in there, and it's a one, it's a single blade. And so if you just throw that away in the garbage can, you know, um, the garbage man or somebody, whatever, you know, can pick it up and maybe cut themselves or whatever. So when you dispose of your, your, your razor blades, what I did, I got a, uh, a bottle here, an old mineral oil bottle for my honing and for my straights, and I cut a little edge in the top of it and I just put my blades in here and so when this gets full I just throw it away I'm not going to be cutting anybody you know I'll be good good to go you want to you want to look out for your other people because even though you've used them a couple times they're still really sharp all right we're going across the grain now Really nice audible feedback on this. I like how the open, open comb kind of pulls your skin a little bit, gives you a nice closer, closer shave. Hope you guys are doing well out there. Staying healthy. Usually I would be going to the game, but I'm still scared. I have a severe ulcerative colitis and it's an autoimmune disorder. Wouldn't wish it on anybody but I cannot get this virus because it would not be good for me in any way, shape or form. Oh man, great two passes. Nice residual glide on this. 
feels good. I could probably shave just with this right now, but I got so much of this awesome soap right here. But this top shelf base, uh, really, really good stuff. Doing three passes today. Get my game day shave on. I'm going to go out to the range and hit a couple of buckets of ball. I've got a uh, nice new hybrid I'm dying to try out. Help me get to those par fives quicker. Man. So Hendrix, they're out of Nashville, Tennessee. Uh, and, and, you know, it's all artesian made here in the United States. Pete does all of his stuff. And I was, I was just talking to him the other day and he's really excited about a couple of new endeavors that he has going on, which I'm can't really talk about, but, uh, I'm excited for the company, you know, Pete's a good guy. And, uh, I've seen a lot of videos done with his stuff and it's all good words about, about, uh, Pete and Hendrix classics and company. And I tell you what, Ray does the artwork on this stuff and just, it just, Incredible, incredible artwork on it. I mean, all right, against the grain. Now, this is where I would be turning my adjustable down. Taking it slow and careful here. I know I got a little... A little nick. I got a pimple right over here that hopefully I'll just cut that sucker off. But they've opened everything up at the football stadium now, and I mean it is like full on, you know, everybody's tailgating again and I love doing that. It's just so much fun on game day. But I can't go. I'm going to watch it on TV here on the Longhorn Network. Oh, baby, that is close. <laughs> that is super close. Uh. Get my fool's pass on. Lots of blade feel, lots of blade feel. And this is a really nice, good, heavy, heavy, heavy razor. I like that. You just lay it on your face. And it does the rest. Whoa. Nice. Nice three passes. Warm rinse. Feels really good. Feels really good. Oh, wow. Oh, you can't beat that. You can't beat that. Cold water rinse. Woo! -hoo. Break out the Lancaster. Oh, that's a clean. That's a clean, close shave right there, folks. Got my Thayer's unscented. Love this stuff. Mm -hmm. 
get my neck. I just did my, just shaved my neck earlier. Mm, that's good stuff. I wonder if you could put that in a spray bottle. <laughs> spray it on there. I guess that's a little overkill, right? And going to finish up with this wonderful Bay Rum balm. And uh, with Pete's stuff, a little bit goes a long way, I got to tell you. I mean, just a little teeny bit is enough for your whole face. Super great scent on this. Nice feel on it, too. My face is going to be nice and protected out there on the golf course today. All right, folks. Hey, thank you again for joining me on my channel, Dougie Shaven. I hope you have an awesome, awesome day, and I'll see you guys again real soon.